Hey guys, today is Tuesday, June 15th, 2021. So I want to show you guys some pretty crazy connections that I got for tomorrow, June 16th. So right here is the logo for CERN, and you can see it forms three sixes. One six there, another six, or a backward six, and an upside down six. So September 10th, 2008, that's when the Large Hadron Collider first turned on, which was developed by CERN. September 10th, 2008 to tomorrow is exactly 666 weeks. So right here, July 16th, 1945, that was the first nuclear test. Uh, the first ever nuclear bomb was detonated in New Mexico called the Trinity Nuclear Test. So when you take July 16th, 1945, to tomorrow, it's exactly 911 months, 911 code. Now when you take the Three Mile Island accident, which was an accident, a partial meltdown of reactor number two of Three Mile Island in Pennsylvania. It occurred on March 28, 1979. It is considered the most significant accident in U.S. commercial nuclear power plant history. March 28, 1979. March 28, 1979 to tomorrow. Look what we have here. 322 code. So, if you've seen my other videos, you know I'm always looking at that 911 code or 322 code, skull and bones. And very interesting that we have the connection with the most significant nuclear accident in the U.S. And it's also exactly 911 months after the first nuclear test in the U.S. Along with the 666 weeks after CERN, the Large Hadron Collider. Right here, August 6, 1945, that was the atomic bomb of Hiroshima. August 6, 1945. To tomorrow is 910 months, one week. Another 911 code. And if we look at the Hindenburg disaster, May 6, 1937, May 6, 1937, to tomorrow, 1,009 months and one week, another 9-11 code. So the combination of all that is pretty amazing. Um, don't know if anything will occur tomorrow, but I'd say it makes it a pretty high watch date. Given the fact that 63 is the numerology for tomorrow, and if you type in nuclear meltdown, well, we have 63 right there. So, am I expecting like a 9 11 event in the US tomorrow? Well, I look at multiple things and I look at the stock market and it's not really giving me a warning that I would normally see if I was going to see like the next big 9-11 event, but we'll see and might, maybe something will happen in another country or will be in the U.S. just not as big or maybe it will be a big event. Uh, I don't know. I just wanted to share the, all this information because uh, all the connections that I got for tomorrow are pretty amazing. So, okay, guys, we'll talk to you next time. Take care.